Hello. <laughs> I feel like I have to speak on this. I feel like there's something telling me to talk about this. God. <laughs> so I'm going to talk on this. I'm very much not doing well and the devil is continually trying to tell me that the Lord has given up on me, that I'm not good enough, that <sighs> that I'm going to hell. And now I'm really starting to struggle with my anorexia. There's a meal. It's just starting to get a little bit harder. And I am saying this because I came to a revelation almost. I don't know if that's the right word. I don't really know what that means, but I came to an understanding. I used to know this and I forgot the devil's attacks will not seem like attacks if you're not Christian. If you're not born again, it won't seem like the devil's attacking you. It won't feel like warfare. It will feel fine. It will feel good even when the devil attacks you because it feels like it's just pleasure and it's just healthy and it's normal and everything you're going through is just how the world is, it's just how everything is and it can even feel good when you're asleep to the truth, when you don't have Christ, when you don't have the Holy Spirit, it can feel good to live amongst evil and the devil, it can feel good, you can convince yourself it's good, we're taught that it's good. The devil has been trying to tell me that God has left me, he's given up on me, and I'm damned and I'm going to hell. That's what he's been trying to tell me. And that's weighing so heavily on me. And I remembered that it feels like warfare if you're saved. It feels like suffering if you're saved. This never used to feel this way. My eating disorder did, but I know this is an attack. He's just trying to fire everything at me that he can. And it's heavy. I feel almost like, as a Christian, you can't be open about the fact that the devil's attacks actually affect you. You have to be a pillar of strength all the time. And I'm not. I have a pillar of strength, and that is God. But my flesh is weak. I am weak. I'm able to fall victim to the devil sometimes, and we all do. I mean, we all, we all are sinners, we all sin every day. So we all do. Some Christians might not admit to it because, like I said, you almost are expected to maintain this image of st st 
tricks all the time. Your walk with Christ can be hard sometimes. will try and get you. He's even attacking my body. Now, I have to stop work sometimes because I just am so tired. I'm so exhausted. Out of nowhere. <laughs> my body is getting sick. He really is trying to attack me however he can and make me doubt it's important in times like this to keep your faith and to cling to cling to it even when the devil tells you you're going to hell and you might even believe it really heavy on your heart even then you have to cling cling to your faith you have to and I really don't want to eat I don't want to eat my food But my dad in heaven loves me, and I'm clinging to that. He loves me, so I have to eat because he wants me to be healthy. is me clinging, clinging to my faith. I am suffering, but I want this to be a message to people also suffering. You're not alone. Not alone. Keep fighting. Keep clinging to God. He loves us. Oh, no, Lord.